Guys, guys. My first design, uh, like the legs of the desk will be plastic bottle, and the board of the desk will be. Uh, I will use bamboo to make it, and uh, this. Your, your legs will be made of these things. Oh, yeah, I'm trying. This can be expanded. The inside of the uh, uh, place. Yeah. Uh, if I want to expand the desk, I can pull in. Okay, so you can make it bigger? Yes. So, the uh, actual dimension, uh, the initial dimension will be 60, 40, 30. But it's for very short people. Oh, it's a sit down yeah, desk. Sit down. Oh, okay. okay. Asian people, sit down desk. <laughs> okay. Sorry? I do not sit down when I go to my desk. <laughs> and how do you, so do you, do, you, do you put your legs like this? No, like <laughs> wow. Actually, by cross-legged, or how do you sit down? Cross-legged. Yeah. So when you sit on a desk, you sit, you sit cross-legged? Yeah. Yeah. It's comfortable. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> no way, man. You sit like this. You sit on the floor like this. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> man, that's... <laughs> Good. Okay, cool. Um, okay. You said your back will hurt, yeah? That's what, that's, that's what I would think. And my legs would hurt. Okay. Uh, also, if you make the plastic bottle, the like this. Yeah. Why would you ever want to do that? Because Why don't you just move I, around the I desk? Change, I change the stick then I want to... Uh, so you're eating? You want to switch to... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're turning your desk around? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just, might just move the plate? <laughs>
Okay. Cool. Um, most creative. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Having a massive block on my desk. Okay. Most useful. <laughs> useful. The first day of the Probably the expandable or the first one, yeah? yeah. Um, most sustainable. <laughs> <laughs> probably the first one or the second one. This one's probably less sustainable because I don't even know she's going to need engine parts to run the clock. She's going to need batteries to run the clock. She's going to need all sorts of stuff. It's not very sustainable, especially batteries. So I don't. I think we have to exclude the last one. Yunyong, you're missing your specifications as well. Yeah. It's very important that you have your specifications. Without those, you can't make any decisions. Um, I have one issue. Um, I like the water bottle ideas. Lots of spare water bottles all around. You think it's strong enough? Yeah. Why? How could you make it stronger? Fill it up, yeah. Or use cans, if you use cans. Another problem I have is, I don't think, maybe it's just me, it looks very nice to mix recycled materials and natural materials. I'm just, because you, your, top, your top you said is going to be wood, yeah? Yeah? So the top is, she's going to have wood on top of plastic. For me that's going to look, I, I don't know, it's personally, just design wise, I think if you choose recycled materials, make the whole thing out of recycled materials. If you choose natural products, make the whole thing out of natural products. Because I think it's, it, it's going to look, um, you're going to sell them, remember? And I'm not sure somebody's going to buy something that's just a beautiful wood top and then some plastic bottles or something. That's the thing. But if you make the whole thing like funky out of recycled materials, then the whole thing starts to look like, you know, it, it, it's got its own sort of um, uh, language. So I think that if you made this out of, if you made the, the, the legs out of these bottles, what could you make the top out of? It's not wood, but it's recycled. Styrofoam. Styrofoam. Cardboard. Cardboard. But that's also kind of. But cars could use cardboard. Is there any plastic you can think of that you could recycle? Because then that is kind of funky looking. Like, what could you use? You could just like remodel it. <laughs> so you mean open it up? Yeah, because that's another idea. You use the. I, I would. I would use, try to make the whole thing out of plastic bottles or. Like make the whole thing out of cans, but like I would try to make the legs as well as the top thing out of um, one material or two materials, but don't mix wood and, and this. Um, maybe I have a better idea. Crack, like this thing. Yeah. Maybe like get a lot of it and combine it with the. Yeah, you can scratch cans. So just use a lot of caps. Yeah, the caps. That would work, but I'm not sure you would have. She doesn't have specifications, but one of your specifications could be how long it would take to do it. If you're trying to make a tabletop out of just caps, it might take you a long, long time. Or, you might run out of caps. You know, Is there a lot of caps? Huh? You know, there's like cans. You can use cans to like make the garments. They cut out the cans. Okay, I didn't see it. Really, anything will uh, we're, we're not worried about safety here. Uh, we're worried about that later. You can sue me when you cut your finger off. Um, but yeah, I think you have to choose one material. I think you have to decide which one would sell the best. I like the idea of making a small desk that you can sit and work on, and I'm kind of excited about the idea of, of sitting and working and seeing how that feels. Uh, but uh, I think you got to think about the design more. And I think you got to think of some material that you can use on top. I like the bottles are kind of cool. And that's going to be challenging as well, how to make it expandable. Because you're probably going to have to make a hole or something and have the bottle in on it. So how, how to make it go up and down. Um, or you just say forget the expandable thing and just make it one size. But uh, the material is going to be hard. You have a lot more research to do. A lot more research. How it's going to fit together, how it's going to... But anyway, but this is the first stage. Okay. Uh, cool.